Yeah, whatever. Key. Right. Um, I don't know what this means. So that's just rotating everything round one. I don't know what I'm trying to get. Is the button. Oh, I can swap these. In. Okay, I'm getting. I'm trying to get the pattern of the moon correct. Um, and I can't. I'm not sure what I meant to do with this though. Ah, uh, no, I'm trying to get these into the right space. So I want to get this one over there, don't I? And I want to get the full moon here. So if I, so I can do that. You're there, and I need to get that one. Like that. Um, or not. So I'm guessing what I actually need to do is... get these all the way through. Oh, I've done this wrong, haven't I? Right, um... Okay, they need to switch around. Oh no, they... Oh, I need... I need the... I need these ones. So switch those, that around. And then... This one that over there. And there as well. Hmm. There at all. That's the one I want up there. And then we. Actually, I want that reversed. So then we go that way. That way. That way. That way. So we've got this side all wrong. There we go. This side's right. Now. No, it isn't. I need to get this there and then that like that. This side is now all sorted. We can ignore it. Around now. Just get this back into the place it's meant to be in. Again, this side sorted. And I just need to invert all of these. So that's like that. Then we just reverse those for a little bit. And now we go back down here. There we go. It was just getting the pattern of the sun, the uh, moon going around. There we go. I healed it. Did. Apparently, there's nothing else to do. Is there? I hope, I hope that it will soon be able to leave again. This region has a something, something has a reputation of being unsafe. Yes. 
Uh, right. Help. What am I meant to do now? Apply. Yes, I've just I've just done that. Should be able to leave again, hopefully. But uh. Oh, your animal is healed. I hope so. We have far to go. I clicked over it. Have you ever managed? I, if you ever managed to leave this place, what do you mean? Listen, do you hear that gro gl growing rumble? It tells me a group of assassins. <gasps> They're real. Is approaching. That sect to control this region, and the master threatens death to all of, of your confession. Perhaps there is a way of negotiating. Don't even think of it. They're not here by chance. Someone must have warned them of your presence, and they do not travel just to talk. Run and take shelter with your father in the fortress, and barricade the door behind you. Once inside, we will be trapped. There is a passage in the courtyard which leads out of the caravanserai. But run now before they see you. I, I, uh, what is? It? Oh, dog! Oh. I'm going up there because you just told me to. Don't pop something up. What is it? We must get to the fortress at once. Fortress at once. Horsemen are arriving and they have something against foreigners. So do not waste time prattling. Run, Marco. Right. We must quickly find a way to block the door. Leave it to me. This fortress reflects for the moment that they will get in eventually. The Bedouin told me of a passageway which should help us to escape. Did he tell you how to find it? No, it's in the courtyard, that's all I know. What are these things? I have a bit of rope, yay. The door may be big, but it will not resist long if the assassins try to break it down. Into the well? Hmm. Ah, I see. What am I doing? Do you want me to press the... Leave it behind it may open the passage that the was talking about. Yes, get rid of him. Wrap it up. Oh, I need the lid. <coughs> oh, I apologise. I have a cold in such a warm climate. How bizarre. Puzzling. I don't know what this I don't know. If I click air. Oh no. Oh, this is a. There's no logic to this, is there? It's legitimately just hitting four. Is there any. I assume that that's what it is. Oh! It's up here, so. Those are the arrows, so it's three, four, eight, nine. Oh, the passageway! I found it! I was clicking on it because that's what the game wants me to do. Well, played my son, let's go at once. The door will not hold for long. <sighs> Finding this annoying with the game. We left the caravanserai beyond our enemy's reach. Without further delay, we continue our route towards the east. Fabulous! If you say so, but the more I think about it, the more my situation weighs heavy on me. What do you mean? I escaped from assassins by fleeing under the Armenian desert. Under? Into? But I'm incapable of getting out of a Genoan Genoese prison cell. Do not be defeatist, Marco. You will not stay forever between these four walls. Perhaps you could request a meeting with the governor and obtain his favours by recounting your extraordinary adventures. Certainly not. The only favours which arouse my desires are those of his daughter, my friend. Uh... You are incorrigible, Marco. Instead of thinking of Miranda, please let us resume. What's the point? <laughs> What's the point of these little interludes? Later, my friend. You look tired. You should get some rest. Sleep has escaped me for years, Marco, but hunger, however, torments me. Is the garden supposed to bring us something to eat? Yes, but he's been sleeping it off. Any And anyway, he cares nothing about his border stomach. I have only a jug of water and a forlornly empty saucepan. I see. Pick up all of the things. Oh, I've probably got some spices or something, haven't I? Noodles! Originally from China, noodles are usually made from wheat or rice. 
The oldest noodles in the world, found near the Yellow River in the northwest China, date back to 2000 BC. That's what you call dry noodles. And they were made from two types of millet. Right, so I assume... These objects don't match. I don't need anything else. Okay, what do I need to do then? Take noodles from chest. Fill pan with water. Oh, boil it. You won't let me boil it. Oh, I need to do it here, don't I? Add the noodles. But what is that, my friend? Noodles. A Chinese dish made of wheat. And how is it eaten? Ah, yes, I was expecting to stay here. I believe I have what you need. Let us confuse Italian people with chopsticks. Chopsticks are cutlery used to grasp foods. They are, are mainly used in Asia. Chopsticks have been used... Or in noodle bars. Ah, uh, I'm really bad at them. I, I, I kind of enjoy it. It's kind of... It's, it's novel. You don't normally use it in Britain. Chopsticks have been used in China since the Shang Dynasty, 15th to 11th centuries BC. They were widely used by the population from the 3rd century BC. Here are the chopsticks. The Chinese use them to eat with. Take one of them as though it were your pen, then slide the other into the hollow between your thumb and index finger. With a little practice, you'll be able to take hold of all sorts of food. Truly, Marco, you never cease to surprise me. I have to admit that I'm not convinced by your chopsticks. Your noodles, on the other hand, are delicious, considering that they're quite bland. Well, I say bland. There's nothing with them. So, Everyone I've introduced them to has appreciated them. I believe that this recipe could go down go down well back home. There we go. I can read. There is no doubt about it. I feel much better and heartily in the mood to commit to paper the next chapter of your adventures. To be honest, I cannot to he wait to hear about the great Kublai Khan. Patience, my friend. We are almost there. Almost there. Oh my goodness. We journeyed over mountains, plains, and deserts to the gates of the Great Khan's summer palace in Kambalu. And while we waited to be received, we set up camp in the neighborhoods of his city, in the heart of a small Mongol settlement, where I discovered the most beautiful of all the wonders of the Orient. The day is over, and we will spend the night here. I have received a missive from the Prime Minister granting us an audience with His Majesty tomorrow. The camp chief has lent us the use of a yurt, but his men must have left hurriedly for an urgent mission and did not have time to finish putting it together. I rely on you to take over. I wish to visit an old friend. Very well, Father. I am obviously the most reliable. Chest contains souvenirs from regions we have traveled to. Alright, what's that one? Framework up, not immediately. Is there something I'm missing? Yes, finish the building. I'm just finished this building. Rope. Okay. Not immediately rope with the framework. Is there anything I'm missing? I don't think so. Rope. Little Hessians. Help! What am I doing? Gather all the parts you need. R frame and then roof. Yes. Not immediately. I'm just finishing this building. I know I need to finish it. What I'm working on? Oh, I need that. Oh! Let's the trellis first. Then the roof. No. Little Hessians? Big Hessian. Rope. Framework. Roof. Hessian, big Hessian. Little Hessians. Rope. Little Hessians. There we go. A foreigner putting together a yurt. Now there is something you do not see every day. Madame, what a vision of loveliness. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Marco Polo. And where do you hail from, my lord? From Venezia, a town on the waters far, far away from this immense empire. I am travelling with my father, a trader in precious stones and silks, but my true aim is to discover the wonders of your world. And on this day I could not ask for more. For you, madame, are the most beautiful of them all. And my heart is yours. Doesn't that madame have an E on the end? Because it's madame. As in, my lady. Maybe that's just in French. But do all your countrymen thus offer their heart right and left, my lord? 
Or do you simply take all the women of the Empire as innocent maids? Forgive me if I was lacking in respect. How do they all know English so well? Well, Italian so well. Come, do not take on so. I'm impressed by the yurt that you've put together. Your curiosity for the Mongol culture does you honour. Would you accept an exchange? P pardon? I have here an object that I'm sure you've never seen before. If you set a light to the fuse, it will rain down stars. If you have with you some objects that I've never seen before, this firework is yours. It's a deal. I'll grab everything. She may be charming, but I cannot give her the holy sepulchre. But I can give her practically everything else, apparently. The obsidian. Asbestos. Yes, let's give her some lung problems. These small black stones are obsidians, are they not? Indeed. I see that it is difficult to surprise you, madame. Uh, silk. What do you say to the silk stole? It is magnificent. Of that there is no doubt. But the silk of Hangzhou is nothing new to me. You should be able to do better than that. Uh, asbestos. Ah, so you have asbestos then. This material, which comes from the highest mountains in the world, has amazing properties to protect you from fire and give you lung problems in older age. But as you see, it is not unknown to me. Purse. My firework is not for sale, my lord. I will exchange it for an object which is unknown to me. What is more, this purse is sewn up. I might believe that you're trying to trick me. Do I use that with that? Ooh, Morano's pearls. Fur. You disappoint me, Lord Polo. Fur is known all over the world. You're right. I'm confounded. I imagine the herds of the great northern plains provide you with all the furs that you could wish for. That is right. Our most beautiful furs come from Siberia. The pearls, then. These beads are magnificent. I've never seen any like them. They're made of coloured glass by Venetian... Then they're not... Oh, Despite all the wonders that I've discovered throughout my travels, I have to admit that nowhere have I found men who could fashion glass like the glass blowers of Morano. I grant you that. So then, it is a deal. I shall keep them in memory of you. Here is the firework I promised you, but take care not to stand too close when you decide to light it. I shall do as you say. And now it is time for me to leave you. Indeed, I see a man approaching. Your father, no doubt. Wait. Farewell, Marco Polo. Uh, I'm delighted to see that you have succeeded in putting together the yurt. I trust that it was not the young woman I saw I just saw running away who did the work for you. But father, who do you take me for? Do not get mad, my son, I am merely jesting. It is time we rested. The great Khan awaits us tomorrow at dawn. You look sad, my friend. Nostalgic. What was the name of that beauty from China? She did not tell me. At least, not that night. Listen, Rustichello, it sounds like the beautiful singer is back. Truly, Marco, no damsel can resist you. Life should not be lived without love, my friend. And the story I've just told you has given me an idea that should win Miranda's heart. But what? What woman would not be moved by a rainfall of stars, Rustichello? Let's take my firework. Firework. Fireworks are pyrotechnic process. Or a pyrotechnic process invented in China, which uses explosive to produce. Sound, light, and smoke. Although, if memory serves, the sound was a later invention by the Italians. 